Hey guys, Cam here from today's iPhone.com and because the holiday season is coming up I'm going to start showing you a few cool interesting iPhone connected accessories that aren't necessarily useful but they are a little bit fun or quirky so um, I've been sent this by iHelicopters.net it's the iRobot uh, iPhone controlled bug now when I saw the picture I was expecting something quite small so when I opened the box the first time uh, to have a sneak peek um, I was a little bit surprised to see just how big this thing is. So I'm going to open this up for you now. Now these cost $39.95. You can buy them from iHelicopter's online store. Uh, let me just switch off my notifications. And here you go. This is the bug. Supposedly a beetle looks more like a cockroach to me thanks to its uh, hideous antenna. But that thing is very ugly indeed. Um, you also in the box you get Obviously our user and instruction manual, um, you get guides on how to charge it, how to use the app. Obviously you need the app to download, it's available on the App Store. If you search i-robots you will find it. Um, and various other things, music switch, all sorts of interesting stuff in there. Um, that's one of the few user guides that I would actually recommend on reading because they are quite useful. And here is the adapter. This is essentially, this is the remote control antenna or um, radio if you like. You connect it to your iPhone using the headset jack um, and obviously once you've got the app loaded and this is charged up then you're free to go ahead. Um, I'm just trying to think now. So this is the actual bug itself. You can see it's hard to zoom in and get actual focus because some of the parts here are quite small. Um, but if I move that out of the way, now you can see here there's a switch, there's an on-off switch um, there's got six legs, they kind of move around a bit and this charged via a little, tiny little port in its backside um, I'm hoping it's got charge already but we'll see, we're going to find out now, I'm going to get the app downloaded and see if I can get this thing to work if not I may just have to charge it downloaded the iRobot app. I'm just going to walk you through this just as I discover it myself just to see how easy or how not easy it is. So if I hit go then I'm going to say I think you have to select which one you've got and I've got the 305, item number 305 which is this one. Okay so I guess I'm going to have to plug this into my headset jack. switch the little bug on there you can see he's lighting up now whoa <laughs> so you control it using these I've zoomed out as far as I can I'm going to move some stuff out of the way this thing is really quite creepy um, I wasn't expecting that at all. Um, <laughs> now that is fun. You can make them go forwards, backwards, go the other way. That is pretty creepy. Now oh, it's gone out of shot. And you can see his body lights up, and I believe his his eyes don't light up, but I'm sure that was supposed to. Never mind. Um, but that's been it. Um, charge them up simply using the cable I showed you before, but that is pretty easy. Okay. And you can see with the app, you can get him to speed up or slow down. Anyway, if you want to ask me any questions about this little thing, um, you can on Twitter. Um, again, 39.95.
Uh, I'm on Twitter, I'm at TIP underscore cam. Uh, I hope... <laughs> this is actually quite a lot of fun, I don't know why. Anyway, I'll see you again soon.